Hey guys, uh, before the ASMR starts, I want to put in a little something if you guys have been wondering where I've been. Uh, I've been sick. I've been very, very sick lately. I have been not well. I have been very ill, mentally and physically. Um, it's like, as soon as I get ready to do an ASMR, I get really tired, I get mentally exhausted, I just, I can't bring myself to make an ASMR, it's like, then one minute my brain tells me to take a nap, and then the next time I take a nap, it's like, eight hours later, and it's like, I wake up, it's like, holy shit, a whole eight hours went by, then I'm too tired and don't want to do it, it's like, I'm trying my best, and I'm really fighting with wanting to not want to quit ASMR, but I've been going back and forth with it a lot, but I won't know until, um, until I know how I truly feel about doing ASMR. So until then, don't worry guys, I'm not leaving just yet. So you'll still get content from me. I just don't want you guys to be like, oh, where have you been? You've been gone for almost a week or so. I just been, as you can tell, I don't, I don't sound well. I've been dealing with a lot. And I'm still waiting for people to commission me. Do I need money for food and clothing? Because my mother is not supporting me or trying to help me at all. So, so she's not, you know, I can't get an actual job due to COVID and all that shit going around. So... I'm really banking on new people wanting to commission me. So my commissions are open, so please consider commissioning me. I do take gift cards from Amazon or Vanilla Visa, but I do get paid in advance. I do not do, oh, can you pay me next week? Can I pay you next week? No, I can't do it. I don't want to get scammed again. So there's that. Um, but other than that, I've been feeling very poorly, so I've been, you know, sleeping a lot and just, you know, have not been well. So, that's all I wanted to do, is get in you know, touch with you guys during this ASMR. Um, I hope you guys understand, and I hope you guys really do commission me, because I really need the money for food and clothing. Because it's getting close to, you know, winter, the cold months, and I really need to buy myself, like, a coat, some warmer pants. I only have, like, light weight things, and a really old hoodie. So, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, so, anyways, please enjoy the ASMR, and I will see you guys in the next video. Ah, oh, yes. Beautiful. Beautiful blood. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh, you're not a fan of blood, are you? <sighs> I guess not. I think I have every swatch of blood from every one I've ever killed, I think. On these little pieces of glass. I think it's such a beautiful color. Every bit of blood is a different shade. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. What do you think? Here, let me show you. I keep them in the freezer so they don't change much color. They still stay the same beautiful shades. Like, look at this one, a little bit darker. But look at this one, a little bit lighter. Aren't they beautiful? Every bit of blood is different. Nothing is always quite the same. Sort of like a snowflake, you know? No, every snowflake is quite the same. Just like blood is not all the same. Some blood is brown. Some blood is darker red. Some blood is even whiter red. Depending on the person or what they eat or what they consume. Interesting, isn't it? How blood can just take on a personality of its own. I find it quite fascinating. I guess you could say I like to ask people their blood type. What color will their blood be when I cut them open? What color will their blood be 
when I ripped them apart? What color will their blood bleed be when I tear them apart? Who knows? <laughs> it's so interesting. It makes me laugh. You know, I was wondering, what color is your blood? How beautiful is your blood, honey? Is it dark red? Light red? Maybe even mahogany? How interesting. <laughs> I don't know what color my blood is. Guess we'll never know. I'm too far dangerous and too far cunning to let anyone get near me to cut me. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't worry. I'm not gonna hurt ya. Not yet. You're too sweet, too delicious, too beautiful, so I'm not going to hurt you. I'm going to play with you just a little bit, but get on my bad side. You never know. I might just hurt you a little bit just for fun. <laughs>